what you are looking at is exactly what you are gonna get. Borderland 3 split screen on a PC. Just download this tool called nucleuscoop.exe, execute it, and find the game. Write Borderlands in this section of the screen and hit enter. You will get the Borderlands 3. You need to download its handler. As you can see in the more info, it is only for Steam version. So keep that in mind. Okay. To download it, I already have it, so it's asking me to overwrite. Okay, then you need to tell the location of your game. That okay, remember borderlands3.exe. As soon as you do this. It will add the game in the list. Okay, and then select it from here. See this particular little icon? Tap it once with your mouse click so it shows like split screen mode. And then put the controls you are going to use for first player on first part and keyboard and mouse if you have another pair or controller on the second. Give it some time and it will start. Fast forwarding it four times so that it doesn't consume our time. Wouldn't it be nice if we could use our additional hardware, spare hardware power to brute force the game to load in such blistering speeds? Okay, now we are loaded. As you can see, the FPS numbers are fluctuating for both the screens. So just cap the FPS. If you have a good GPU, you could cap higher. I have a card that can handle 60 FPS, 40 to 60 FPS. So I'm going to cap it at that. You could check what amount of FPS works for both the instances of your game it also depends upon your setting i am using the ultra settings optimized settings then you can just connect it like this you can also change your players there is no problem in that whenever you load the screen it will be the same player for both the screens so you have to manually change it every time you play the game again and there it is both of you are going to share the same name mine is Mephistopheles so it is going to show that right I remember one thing uh, you the first instance mouse might not work as soon as you get inside the game so you have to press the end key remember this and then click once and it will map your mouse to the first instance and if the second person controller is con trying to control both the instances just disable it from the menu in the first instance that's it for this video. I am Rohit Joshi from Indivanup and I will catch you in the next video.